Well, holiday, everybody. I uh, got some new packages in the mail today, which is uh, quite impressive. I actually have to throw out some props to FedEx. I live in Wisconsin. We had a blizzard today, and FedEx still delivered packages on time. I, uh, I had to meet them at the, the end of my driveway. I live way out in the middle of nowhere, but sure enough, they made it. But I've got a couple of big packages here and one small one. But uh, one of these is a guitar, one of these is a guitar case. I ordered a Michael Kelly 10 string guitar, the Triad 10E. And I have to tell you, I'm very excited to open this up. Um, the reason I'm doing the video is because there is a distinct lack of videos about anything on this guitar on YouTube, which is shocking. I did not expect that at all. I expect there to be lots of reviews and everything. All I could find were about four or five videos of this particular guitar. And we are packaged away safely, that's for sure. Very, very safely. Boxes are just a little cumbersome. All right, that's exciting. Michael Kelly Guitars. Built on sound. Thanks from all of us at Michael Kelly Guitars. Post it, tweet it, share it, which is exactly what I'm trying to do here. All right. Still not sure if I have the guitar or the case in this particular box. All right, yep, this is the case. Well, this is interesting. I was a little surprised to see that there were two boxes that came. I actually expect them to ship it in the case. Um, that's the couple guitars that I've ordered that's usually how they do it but apparently that's not how they did it here which I'm sure they actually probably got it packaged a little better in this box but case it's a brown case I was expecting black not that it it didn't say either way and I really didn't pay that close of attention to it all I knew is that I needed a hard case for it I uh, had already broken one guitar headstock that uh, I absolutely still love that guitar. It uh, ended up getting fixed, but yeah, it was not fun. Branded case, has a lock on it. Ooh, nice velvety inside. Yeah, I believe that'll work. Now for the fun part. I can't tell you how excited I am for this part. All the pictures I found online of these guitars, they are absolutely gorgeous for starters. And yes, you did hear me right before, it is a 10 string. Now your typical standard guitar is a six string. I'm sure anybody watching this knows that. And I'm sure you've all heard of a 12 string, but uh, Michael Kelly Guitars decided they would drop the octaves on the two bass strings so you get a nice cleaner, clearer bass note, thus making a 10 string. Seemed like a legit idea to me. I've been wanting to get a 12 string. I've never owned a 12 string. I've been wanting to get one for years and I actually saw this ad come up on Facebook and immediately knew I had to have one. All right, we are packaged quite, uh, quite well. 
Doesn't seem like anything's gonna go anywhere that you don't want it to. Got the tools. I see uh, fishman.com uh, little mail-in thing. This does have the Fishman electronics on it. Oh. That is a beautiful guitar. The weight headstock is obviously just a little heavier than my, uh, say my, my Taylor is. Got a couple more tuning pegs on there, so yeah. Um, overall, it's it's quite light. It's uh, it has these tone ports up here. Well, tone ports. I don't know exactly what they call them. I think that's the term that they use. These ports up here, so, um, made so that while you're playing it you actually get some of the sound coming up towards you, a little bit of a, a monitor system, if you will. But uh, makes it kind of interesting. You can fully see inside of the acoustic, which you normally can't do. The uh, You can see all the electronics in there. Got a couple of knobs right here. I'm sure one of them is tone, one of them is volume. I don't know, I haven't played with it yet. But uh, this is a beautiful guitar. It definitely lives up to everything that I've seen online. That headstock, nice, nice flamed headstock. Um, I'm not even going to try and remember exactly what kind of wood that was on there, but it looks beautiful. Um, it's called the Triad 10E because it has these three sections back here. And I hope you're seeing this flame in there. The flame in that wood is absolutely gorgeous. It has a uh, wood purfling, I believe is the term for it, around the edges. Oh, beautiful guitar. Everything I was hoping for when I saw it online. Um, what are the chances it's even close to being in tune? Now that is impressive. You literally just saw me pull it out of the box. And uh, yeah, it, it sounds, it's very well tuned already. I, um, I'm gonna have to do a full review again at some point. Um, yeah, there's, I'm surprised by the lack of reviews for these guitars already. Um, I will do a full review. This is just the unboxing, but so far, I'm liking what I'm hearing. Yeah, I'm not much of a 12-string player, so uh, I don't know any interesting 12-string licks to throw out there right away. Beautiful. Well, thank you all for watching, and uh, yeah, check back again in a couple weeks. I'll have a review. Have a good night.